I've never been in a relationship because um, I don't even know the reason. It's I don't know. Like my friends are always trying to pressure me, not like pressure me in a negative way, but like oh, my friend. Like if I go out with them somewhere and there's there's a boy and he'll talk to my friend and he'll be like, oh, can I have your friend's number? And then she'll come up to me and be like, oh, can you have your number? And then I'll be like, no. And then my friends are always like, oh, you're harsh and things like that. I don't know why. Like, <laughs> I don't know. I'm trying to figure that out myself. Like, why am I like that? Like, if I'm around someone I like, then I get butterflies and things like that. Like, I just feel, like, smiling and sort of excited. <laughs> but then it's, like, I think, calm down, walk away from the situation. <sighs> you see, the thing is, like, I don't like to do anything about it. I like to just go. It's like, I don't want this to go any further, so it's like... It's like, that's when I put that barrier and I'm just like, no, stop, move away. <laughs> Even if I was attracted to someone, I don't think, like, right now is a good time for a relationship. And that's why I try to avoid it. Because, like, right now, it's... <sighs> I remember when I was at school and there was... That, that was when a lot of people started getting into relationships, like, around 14, 15, things like that. And even then I was like, oh, um, I don't think I want to be in a relationship right now because, like, like, I need to focus on my education. And, like, there's a lot going on in my life right now. And, like, my time's being taken up, so I don't think a relationship is the best thing. And also, like, loads of my friends were losing their virginity at that age. And I really didn't want to lose my virginity because, like, I knew loads of them were, like, regretting it. Sort of, like, oh, I was so stupid, like... Then relationships lasted max three months until he gets bored or she gets bored and then it's just like, it's over. And I don't think like I could put up with that. Like, I would be devastated if that happened to me. So that's why I was like, oh no, not right now, I'm too young. So then I was like, maybe later on. But then even when I went to college, I was thinking, oh, I've got my A-levels right now and work and things like that. And like, do I even have time for a relationship? So, uh, I don't know when the right time is. <laughs> but not right now. <laughs> so, okay. Um, I'm Amy and the person I was playing is called Jessica. <laughs> um, I feel like she's a person who, she does want things. And I think... She really does genuinely want things, but I think when it actually comes to having what she wants, there's so many faults and worries and stories that instead of actually just going for it and seeing what's happened, she'd rather just not go for it and just have the idea of it, which I can sort of relate to. I think, like, in life, there's a lot of situations where you'd rather just dream about it than actually go for it, because if you go for it, it might be complete shit. And then, like, I'm... I suppose, like, her age is usually when people do lose their virginity. So she might be feeling that extra pressure because she feels like, oh, the longer it is, the more I'm not going to know about it and more people are going to know more than me. So I feel her pressure. But I sort of also feel like I understand how she feels in maybe a different situation. Maybe not necessarily sex because I've already had sex, so I don't have... I still have those worries, like, when you're with someone new, it's like, oh, God, like... It's good you never know what the other person is thinking, sort of thing. So I think that's maybe her main thing, because it's something she's never done, and she really wants to do it. Because I think a lot of people, they're like, oh, you don't want to have sex because you're scared of it. I don't think she's scared of it. I think she really wants to do it, but I think she's just worried that it won't be what she wants it to be. And that's my thoughts on her. <laughs> I just advise her maybe maybe to give boys her age a chance because I think that yeah they might be a little bit immature but they might bring out her sort of immaturity a little bit not that you need to be immature about it but just maybe lighten it not make it so stressful and like but also make sure she doesn't just do it because she wants to get out of the way just make sure she, 
I do like the way that she's like, oh, I don't want to just go with someone because they like the way I look. But then again, you don't necessarily have to do anything with them. You could just meet up with them again, see what they're like, and if you don't like them, then you might just have to do the old, oh, my phone's broken, I can't text you. <laughs> but I'd say, don't, most of all, don't feel pressured. But maybe, maybe, like, if you met someone you were comfortable with them, tell them that you feel pressured, so don't pressure me. And if you do, tell them to piss off. <laughs> but no, yeah. I'd say she has, she has a good head on her shoulders, but maybe just have a little fun. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>